These are putty exercises for increased finger, wrist, and hand strengthening. And so first you want the patient to wash their hands uh, and dry them off before they touch the putty. That way it's not um, contaminating for the next person. So we have different putties of different strengths, so depending on what the therapist or even the patient's ability is, go ahead and give this to them first. So for him, we're just gonna use the right hand first. The first thing we're doing is squeezes. So just letting it sit in his hand and just squeezing it, rolling it around in his hand a little bit, just back and forth that way. And you can go ahead and set a timer for this. He'll go for one minute, twice, just going back and forth and squeezing it in different positions, trying his best to get all his fingers to work and not letting his whole uh, arm and shoulder get activated as well. So his, his shoulder and elbow should be relaxed, sitting on the chair there. The next thing he's doing is just gonna pinch, and he's gonna pinch in opposition, meaning in each finger. So his thumb first and his first finger, his thumb and his middle finger, his thumb and his ring finger, and then his pinky, and then we'll repeat that cycle through. This one we can do by repetitions as well, um, one set of five or one set of 10 with each of these. Um, unless you just want to go in for time, is that's absolutely fine. Twice for a minute is fine as long as you can tolerate that. We can go ahead and try the next one, which is pull-aparts. And so with both hands, making sure that that uh, finger, it depends on which one they want to do, they can do each of them. First finger and thumb and just pulling apart that way. Good. Getting that opposition going with that strength of that as well. This can also be four, twice for a minute, just going back and forth, or you can count by repetitions, two sets of 10, two sets of 15, whatever it might be. Next, we can put the roll on the, on the ball, or on the table here, and we're gonna roll it. So using those fingers to extend the fing extend them out and roll them up. So making sure that it's all coming just from the hand, nothing from the wrist, nothing from the elbow necessarily, but it's just finger extension and flexion. For this one, we can do for a count of one set of 10, two sets of 10, um, or we can go for time. The very last one is the spreads, which is a difficult one, so the last of the series. Just gonna roll it up and then flatten it out on the floor or on the table. Your fingers start close together and you're just extending those fingers with some resistance into extension there. That was a pretty tough one, so you roll it back up and do it once again. So we'll count this out for about one set of five, maybe 10 if they can tolerate it. Um, again, they can modify this with increased resistances. Um, the beige one is the easiest one. We also have the red, green, um, and blue. Blue is the hardest one that we have. That's the most firm. So those are our putty exercises. We started first with the putty squeeze, the putty pinching, the putty rolling, the pull-aparts, and then the spreads.